So what we're doing is we're cooking some potatoes. We got your potato peeler here and we just um, slice and peel the potato. It's really hard to pull, peel potatoes and stuff. But yeah, you got it like that. And it just peels off. And then you just take your peeler. We got it about peeled, saying four potatoes for french fries. I got a potato peeler. Why don't I use it? That's what I'm like. And then we'll cut. What? I didn't peel this one. Then we'll wash it off. Oh, uh, this looks like it got old. And it's white again. Once you peel a potato, you cannot refrigerate it. We got that down. Now let me peel this potato. Turn the wash off. You know what? I don't even feel like peeling it. I wanna make french fries immediately. Ooh, you could cut yourself on this pillar. It's bad. Sometimes you don't even need to peel it. I'm just peeling it for fun. I'm just gonna make french fries with it. And so we got our peeled potatoes. We just set that aside making french fries today so we're gonna cut and put it in the oil and we gotta salt it up and fry them fries up until it's soggy oh man a little a little water so it gets right it'll get right with a little water Dice it into cubes. And dice it sideways. You're making those big, huge fries. Wild wavel fries. I'm making like some kind of wavel fries. Wavel fries are curly, so I guess I'm not making that. But I'm making something. It's looking good. I wish I could potato better. Cut this in half. Cut this in half. Just put a whole bunch of salt in there. And then fry it up. And then I can peel this more. I could peel that some more. I can just put it in the Tupperware and peel it off later and fry it anyway for my second batch. And this is what the fries look like. And they're gonna be looking so restaurant style. Like all I gotta do is cut the tips and have these big old fries. Just throw some salt in there. Here's my salt, I found it. Just throw some salt in there and salt up the fries and that's all you gotta do. And then kick the stove on 
Move this to your potato peeler, your second batch of fries, and just fry it in the frying oil all day. And that should be good. I'm making my fries.